have i always been this well-spoken or this is something you've worked on over time um which you say i'm well-spoken and then i say um so i took a lecture class in college and i really think taking that class like learning how to present really helped me uh and helped my education so i really think college did it i've always been well spoken like then uh, you know i say my thoughts but i think the lecture class really helped however i think right now currently i'm trying to get off a medication because i think it's giving me brain fog to the point where i, I get can't run! recall like my recall is really bad. Shit, girl, I am behind on my schedule. No, don't call me out like that. No, no, I'm not. Look, look, 3 p.m. Feeling awesome. Look, 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 it's 3.03. I'm one chug away. I'm killing it. <laughs> Public speaking was one of the best classes I took in undergrad. It really helps you. I'm so I'm still looking for the tea on the awards party. Well, here's some tea before, and this is like maybe I shouldn't tea. Maybe I shouldn't. I don't know. I mean, but it's all on Twitter, so it's like it's public domain. I would log into my Twitter, but you might see like more. So let me see if I can just find it first. I don't want to accidentally, I don't want to be logged into my Twitter, even my safe one, and randomly, like, some butthole pops up. I'm banned for a week. Your brain fog is unreal. You thought I'd been in Vegas for the past month. I know, it's so bad. I actually talked to my doctor about it, and he says that he thinks it's a product of the all the medication, and he's like, you just need to take less. So I'm trying to slowly take less gabapentin and then also I think it's the product of just being in pain as well. You go tomorrow? Okay, I was gonna ask if you were there already. <laughs> oh my God. I think it's just the gabapentin, yeah. Because when I when I go off of it for like two days, I'll fuck around and go off of it for two days by myself. Um, and then of course, yeah, I'll be in a lot more pain, but my recall is 10 times better. I did get veneers on my bottom teeth, yeah. I mean, they look like they're the same size as my other teeth, my old teeth. Did you find your outfit for the thing tomorrow? So I didn't. Um, I decided I was just gonna look through my clothes. I have an awesome uh, PA here who's helping organize my closet. So I figured I would go through my clothes tomorrow and figure out what I wanna wear. I think I'm just gonna wing it, fuck it. God damn it, now I gotta finish drinking this. Is there any downside to having veneers? So there are downsides to having veneers. I will say if you don't need them, then you shouldn't get them. They tend to be, they're kind of like the it, it, procedure um to where like if you go to any doctor or anything like that they're gonna be like oh yeah just give veneers but what i think you should do is if you don't need them don't get them just whiten your teeth if you have certain stains on your teeth and stuff yeah for sure get them but make sure you're doing it with a doctor who's not gonna completely grind your teeth down so underneath my teeth these ones these are just front frontal ones right so underneath my teeth they're a little bit smaller than this. They're not ground completely down. Underneath all my teeth up here, they are basically the same size, except for my eye teeth. And then one tooth in the back, he really ground down because I needed a root canal, right? But if I were to lose any of these teeth, like accidentally break one or chip one, it wouldn't be noticeable. Like it would be like noticeable, but it wouldn't be crazy because I had veneers one time that were really thick and you could see the difference when I broke. And you have to just make sure you go to a good dentist because they use different labs and different techniques. Memory problems are definitely a side effect of gabapentin. I've actually never even read the side effects, but for sure. Yes, it's the pain in gabapentin. In my case, the brain fog just translates as I get sleepy and go to bed. So I just upped my antidepressant by two. Oh, 
Oh, girl, I I think I think I opened it the other day because I have a box of it. Thank you, Auntie Cat. Either that or I didn't yet because I do still have a box of stuff to open. But I know that I have more in here now, so that's good. <laughs> Thank you for always keeping me from getting sick. Uh, what antidepressant do I take? Bu 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 I can't ever say it. Bupropion? Bupropion? I'm not going to say never to not getting lip filler, but I don't want to get lip filler. It's not my goal anymore, but I'm not going to say I won't ever. Again, you never know. Heavy Gruff, thank you for the sub. Can they just not like whiten them without putting in fakes after grinding the real ones or is it not a thing? So once you take the, the first layer of enamel off, you have to put something over top of it. Oh, okay, okay. Then you know what? It's in my garage because Thomas takes all the mail that comes to my house and puts it in my garage and organizes it. So I need to go out there. I sent a three pack of low draft. I haven't gotten it yet. So I might have gotten it. Dude, that Mario is going to be public. What does that mean? No, I'm not actively shooting. Thank you for always taking care of me, Auntie Cat. I'm gonna go check that when I do the next load of laundry in an hour. Thank you, Martin. Thanks so much. I'm just dealing with a little bit of color, just uh, color, like darkness, melasma, and then I also have a little bit of scarring from injection points that I'm trying to work off, like color-wise, doing little peels. No, girl, I haven't found the Jenga pieces. I'm missing a lot. I'm missing so many Jenga pieces. That's why it's still out, because I'm like, I can't put it away until I find them. Hello, Fork. Hello. You can come up here. You want to come up here? Hello. Are you okay? You were drunk. <laughs> yeah, I'm okay. <laughs> I'm okay. I had a good time. Mark is adorable, isn't he? He's such a good man. He really is a good man. He's been so good to her. 